Island uh, 98.5, Star 101.9. Uh, we also have uh, KHBZ, our 9, AM 990 talk station, uh, 93.9 Jams, et cetera, et cetera. So uh, it's a great, great company with uh, a lot to offer. We hope that you enjoy listening to any and all of our stations. Uh, the room tonight, uh, and by the way, we use this for everything. I've done programs where we've had the uh, U.S. Marine Corps band that would perform, and then we would broadcast live. Uh, we've had programs where Jack Johnson would fill out the room. We have uh, Jimmy Borges who performed here not long ago. Your friend is a really great room. I, I hope uh, you find it comfortable. So that's kind of it for a treat. And uh, <laughs> it's almost out of necessity. The timing could not have been better. Uh, I've shared on the air that after the start of the new year, I don't know about you. Keep it up for a minute. I took a pretty good hit. And the devaluation of the market uh, really affected my retirement. Uh, it, it, if you felt the same way, I was literally on the air every day, groaning <laughs> audibly whenever a business report would come or whenever I would share the business numbers. Uh, the precarious nature of markets, we understand if you're a little bit more aggressive, you have a little bit more risk. But I don't think anybody was expecting a 2008-2009 style devaluation where we are. So I am uh, 54. I'll be 55 in November. Uh, it's important to me that I that I have a sufficient amount of revenue to take care of growing the kids. And Frank and I have spoken uh, again gratuitously around the holidays, and he was gracious enough uh, to spend about two and a half three hours to really walk me through the strategies that he and Josh, American Money Group, employ for their friends and clients. I actually just got off the phone with one of Frank's uh, clients. Uh, Alan and Linda uh, live in California. Alan is, he must be 80. Close to it. Close to 80. Spark plug, this guy. Uh, just uh, full of life, full of vim, vigor. And I asked him, just, what did you make of your relationship with Frank and how long have you been with him? And Alan says, well, we've been together for about five years. I said, what was it about what Frank does that, that led you to work with him? And the first thing he said was, trust. Trusted Frank, and that was off the get go. And then he understood what the process was. And he asked about a million and a half questions, I think, is the way he described it. But the bottom line is, they are in great financial shape. Uh, words he would using was wonderful, tremendous, etc. But he has a tremendous amount of affinity for Frank and his family personally. And we spoke more about that relationship than really the nuts and bolts of our investment. So, you know, we're, we're, we have a bit of a dilemma. We, we have a lot of our investments that may be tied to the markets. But we have to understand one thing, and I know this as well for years, is that when you're offered investment opportunities, sometimes you're presented programs that's kind of like a one-size it's all. It's kind of, well, we're going to go through the various yeah. traditional steps of the investment areas. And unfortunately, it doesn't fit all. We have our own individual needs and our own individual goals. So tonight, uh, Frank is going to walk you through. Uh, the beautiful part about it, as you can see, there's nothing for sale. We're not, there's nothing other than, hopefully, if you have a pen and paper, you can take some notes. And the only thing I do ask for two things is, please ask questions. Please ask a question. I didn't ask a bunch myself. And the other thing at the end is to set a time. And it's just a time where you can talk with Frank or Josh or another member of the family and find out exactly how something that they have constructed can work for you. So all of that said, it's a pleasure to welcome uh, our speaker tonight, our dear friend, ladies and gentlemen from American Money Group. This is Mr. Frank Peck. Well, I'd like to use the microphone. I hope that's going to be okay. You know, and I don't.